booted up. Five years have passed since bloody civil war was brought to an end in the Republic of Altus. Thousands of families remain displaced. Refugees scattered across countries around the Mediterranean. With the U.S.-led peacekeeping deployment coming to an end of its mandate, NATO forces... As millions of dollars of military equipment and infrastructure is decommissioned, opinion is split as to the wisdom of the drawdown. In light of CSAT forces stepping up joint military exercises in the Pacific. The U.S. is keen to reorient its conventional forces, reinforcing... The Mediterranean Basin representing a strategic fault line between crumbling European... and ...argue that the withdrawal could not come at a worse time. AAF forces begin to consolidate their position... ...on the backing of Canton Protocol forces, equipment and training. Fire again. Parliament was recalled for an urgent debate and a vote over the possible redeployment of British peacekeeping forces. Prime Minister Nicholas Ramsden said he would respect the defeat of his government's motion. Effectively ruled out the possibility of any extension to the NATO deployment in the former sovereign territory.